do you see that? Do you see that? Do you see all this? Do you see the greatness in front of you? Teddy bear. Do you see the greatness in front of you? What do you see? You see that big fucking screen TV, the consoles, all the games were in that closet. But do you see this? This wonderful, luxurious table. And what is on top of it? I see my 27-inch iMac desktop, all wireless, all around. My HP screen, 27-inch, 19 by 1080. All right, got it on sale, 200 bucks. Originally 500. That is Terra Online and a fucking Arizona. That is the Logitech G35 headset, 7.1 surround sound, and that right there, gentlemen is a custom-built, high-powered, future-fucking-proof, ultra-mega, better-than-yours PC. Yes, I have made my return to fucking PC gaming, okay? You see that? You see that right there? Fuck that, and fuck that. Fuck these two things right here. Fuck the big-ass TV. This is all I need. This is all I fucking need. This desk, all right? Ultra, ultra, ultra fucking over the top orgasmic gaming experience. And a fucking iMac with titties. Do you not understand? This machine is running off an NVIDIA 690. I run Counter Strike Source and the latest games. At 300 fucking frames per second. Now you say to yourself, well, your eyes can't keep up with, you know, no more than 60. But you know what? Fuck you. I got special eyes, motherfucker. My shit keeps up with fucking 300 frames per second. I am playing Counter Strike Source like this. It's crazy. You wish you had this shit. You wish you had this fucking monster of a PC. You know? You got all these fucking console reject faggots on YouTube talking about what's better, Xbox 360, Xbox 360. I got news for you, faggot. It's all, for, it's all about the fucking PC. All about the PC. The graphics, the frame rate, the control, the community. Holy shit. Ya hella jelly. Suck my fucking dick. Click that like button. Add me to your favorites. And catch you guys next video. Ya niggas hella jelly. What's going on guys? My name is Skill37 and if the beginning of my video offended you in any way then you are a faggot and you need to get off the goddamn internet. But um, yeah, uh, where have I been and why and what is up and what will I be doing? Uh, I recently moved, right? I live in a big ass house so I decided to move up to you know my own apartment and set up my dream game room basically. And if you follow me on Facebook, I talk a lot about it. And I posted a bunch of pictures and gave you guys, like, in a sense, what my room looks like. But, um, you know, my dream game room is basically complete. Right? I made sure it was, like, the first thing that we got done in my big-ass apartment. I got the kitchen, master bedroom. I got two walk-in closets, uh, a walk-on roof, a bathroom, and everything. But this is the living room. We ch and I turned it into, like, this ultimate gaming setup. Behind me is... Um, you know, the badass bed and that bear belongs to my girlfriend. So if I get any goddamn comments, you can suck a dick. And the bear's name is Bear. But yeah, I have a big ass room. And um, basically, you know, I got the TV behind me, with the consoles, um, shit like that. Obviously, from the beginning of the video, you obviously saw my new rig. You know, very powerful, custom built PC. And, um, you know, that's pretty much why I've been gone for so long, because I've just been concentrating on work, my girl, and, you know, putting together this fantastic, fantastic room. And I'd like to thank, you know, right now, the Anti-Martyr and Dream 308, because it was these two that built my PC. I told them money was not an issue, go for it, you know, build me a monster. 
you see a lot of people have been telling me why don't you just build a PC I'm not I'm not new to PC gaming I've done this before like everyone I started off on Nintendo then PlayStation 1 and 2 and then um, I got into PC gaming for years I played Final Fantasy Online Counter-Strike a bunch of other PC games for years and then you know my, my PC was hit with a bunch of viruses and shit and it was just unusable so I invested in consoles and I played consoles for a minute but I want to get back into PC gaming and now that I am financially stable, I got my career rolling, basically my life just kicks so much fucking ass right now. Like, I'm living the dream right now. And um, it's, not, you know, it's time for me to get back into what I really wanted to get back into for a long time, that was PC gaming. Um, I want to thank the anti martyr and Dream Theory for building this PC. Because, like I said, it's, it's a monster. This thing has an NVIDIA 690. And I can play Source games at 300 plus frames per second, like nothing, with all the settings on max, like it's all good and shit. I'm taking advantage of the Steam sale, excuse me, the Steam sale. I got Left 4 Dead 2, Metro 2033, The Witcher 1, I got Witcher 2 on Xbox, um, Killing Floor, you know, both Counter-Strike 1.6, Source, a bunch of other games I have in the past, like Torch Light. Uh, I picked up Terra Online because I love MMOs. I may not look it, but I, I am an MMO fucking fanatic. And I love my MMOs. I got a piece of shit keyboard and mouse because I ordered the Death Adder mouse from Razer and the Black Widow keyboard, mechanical keyboard from Razer, and I got to wait a little week for that shit. So CyberPower PC was cool enough to give me a piece of shit mouse and keyboard that I probably would never even consider even spending $5 on a piece. But I got me a nice little Logitech little headset, 7.1 surround sound. Uh, it's the Logitech G35 series. Really good so far. The base is incredible. I think it's great considering the price I got it for. Got it for cheap. And that's pretty much it. Like, I've been concentrating on the house, you know. I'm going to start bringing you guys more videos now. And I'm really going to get really into PC gaming to the point where I might not play consoles, like, ever. Granted, I'm going to keep my consoles. I really love my PS3 to death. You guys really know that. I love my Uncharted. I love my... Naughty Dog in general, and the PS3 is where it's at when it comes to them console exclusives. As far as my Xbox 360 is concerned, I'm not so sure about Halo 4 and Gears of War anymore. I'm saying why bother with those games when I know I'm not going to play them for that long. I, I, I play the single players and like put them to the side, but I just spent a fuck ton of money on um, the tower, the screen, which is an HP 27 inch 5MS 19, 19 by 1080 over 3 million fucking pixels or whatever. It's just an amazing screen. That cost about hundred dollars. I got it for two hundred due to the July Fourth sale. And this PC was actually, I, even though I got it for three grand, it was actually considered on sale because I got it during July Fourth sale. A lot of people are gonna tell me why did you not build a PC? And you know, if you claim that you played PC game before, you're familiar with PCs. Like the high school I went to, you couldn't graduate unless you were familiar with PCs to some extent. And the reason is that is I make good money and I don't feel the need to fucking build a PC. I think it's stupid. Because what's a couple hundred dollars to make? That's all it really costs. Like you have to consider the, the parts for PC, especially if you bought, if you get the PC I got. I built the PC that's future proof. My PC was gonna be expensive regardless. So I said to myself, you know, fuck it, um, whatever. I'll learn how to put things together like Lego blocks later on in the game. I'm going to invest in uh, some programs to learn how to utilize my PC to its fullest. But for now, I was like, fuck it, you know. I don't feel like waiting weeks and weeks and weeks and weeks to months on individual parts. I find it stupid. Why wait for individual parts when I make good money, I have an excellent career, and I can just order everything in one big fucking shot, you know, and for a couple extra hundred bucks more than it's professionally put together, professionally updated, professionally wired, everything. So fuck it. You know, I work a day overtime, and I can pretty much pay for a third of the PC already. So it's all good. You like my hat? I love my hat too. But yeah, uh, PC Gaming is where I'm going to be at. If you'd like to add me on Steam, it is my name, Hector underscore Mercado. I'm going to leave all the information in the video description below as usual. Follow me on Twitter. Follow me on Facebook. I'm very active on Facebook. And I am updating the shit out of this PC. I am, I just got it, the uh, Bit Defender, the best, high, most highly rated um, antivirus, etc. that money can buy. Very expensive. Got three-year protection. Got my gunner shades ready. The sound you hear in the background of my vacuum. And uh, yeah, I got the new apartment. It's great. And, you know, can't wait to get back into making videos. I know you, some of you guys is like, where the fuck the videos at? And I'm like, I'm busy, I'm busy, I'm busy. And I don't really tell people what I'm busy with. I just tell them I'm busy. But that's pretty much it. Uh, 
My girl's on vacation, so this is going to give me some ample time to get into that PC gaming. She's all like, I hope this PC doesn't interfere with our relationship. And, you know, I'm all like, no, oh, of course not. And the little devil beside me is like, <laughs> and I'm like, good oh, boy. But yeah, Terra Online cannot fucking wait. Uh, yeah, that's where it's at. If you want to play Midnight Counter Strike Source and get your ass handed to you, remember Hector underscore Mercado. Once again, you know, subscribe, follow me on Facebook, Twitter, tell your friends about me, blah, 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 blah. Thank you once again, Anti Martin and Dream Theory for helping me build this PC. You know, uh, shout outs to Black Font, you know, Hump Master Flex, fucking awesome dudes. Um, Hard Eight Times, pretty, um, pretty cool dude, just needs to get a sense of humor, you know. You're a pretty cool dude, but you, <laughs> oh my god, like, you, you take the silliest things too, too seriously. Like, it, it, this is gaming, man, just, just, I'm not even gonna get into the subject about that, but just calm the fuck down with this shit. And, uh, yeah, for everyone else that wants to add me on, uh, PSN, Xbox 360, I'm LOL skilled 87 and, uh, yeah, you know, at one point when I was making videos, I was all for the PSN. I think it's about to change, man, because... 300 frames per second. But yeah, catch you guys next video. And uh, as always, thank you for your continued support. Be sure to support thuggeek.com. That is the website I'm part of. I will start bringing that website lots of reviews for PC gaming. And of course, I will not be forgetting the upcoming games such as Assassin's Creed 3, Darksiders 2, you know, fucking Resident Evil 6. I cannot wait for any of these games. That's why I'm holding on to my consoles. But yeah, um, that's all I gotta say for now. And, you know, another day, another dollar. Peace. No, you can tell them all now